it because I think of all of the exciting pieces to XR that we think that that are truly unique and and, and dynamic. I think the Rion story um, and that partnership is 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 a really incredible one to sort of let everyone kind of um, hear. I mean, it's it's an amazing material and and has some properties that are industry unique for for football. And I would love for you to to dive into that a bit. Yeah, I mean, it's it's great in that, I mean, so Rion Labs is a, a company out of the UK, which we partnered on um, this incredibly innovative sort of technology on. And Rion is also what we call the material technology. So it's sort of it's our collaborator here as well as the material uh, solution. And, and really, it's nothing short of our biggest, I would say, single sort of advancement in Zenith helmet technology um, since the incep inception of the company, you know, roughly 10 years ago. Um, and so I have here, you know, one of the Rion shots here in blue, um, standard color will be more so the, the gray that you're seeing here in the clear shell. Um, and it's really, it comes down to sort of two primary attributes of this new Zenith shock. One is the material, which is the Rion material. And the second is the geometry. So how that material, what shape is that, is that material formed into? On the material side, it is incredibly unique in the way it actually intelligently strengthens under impact. And so what I mean by that is when you think about the spectrum of impacts that an athlete will see throughout a game and a season and certainly a career, there are more frequent sort of lower level impacts. So many, many lower level impacts. Um, think of alignment on the line, right? Um, all the way up to sort of the less frequent but more severe impacts. So you have this great range of impacts, which we have to control against and certainly design and engineer for. And what Rion does is it maintains an optimal behavior to mitigate the energy at those low level impacts, as well as at the high level impacts. And so that's enabled by this really intelligent behavior that we, that we ascribe to it, where it actually strengthens um, under a higher speed uh, impacts. So it actually better controls energy um, when it's impacted at lower speed because of the softness of the response, and then it stiffens up at those higher speed impacts. So it's the material, but then it's also important how you actually utilize that material and the geometry that it's formed into, not only from an energy control perspective, but you also want to bring the weight down, right? So you want to utilize the material as efficiently as possible. And so here, a really unique and novel aspect is what we call this reentrant geometry shape. So you can see it kind of looks like a castle essentially a series of castles, which we call our Rion cells. These cells are designed such that the top has a very soft, compressive behavior. But again, as you, as you engage more and more of that material, it stiffens up to better control sort of that loading curve as it comes into the, as it comes into the helmet system. So better separating the athlete from the hit is the idea here. And so those are the two primary components. You have the material and then the geometry, which comes together into a really innovative Rion shock in the Shadow XR. Yeah, and it, it's, it is a really exciting and impressive and, and, and very revolutionary adaptation for football. I mean, we've seen it in motorsports, and I think we discovered it in, in motorsports originally or motocross. Um, and so there's a lot of very high speed impacts and things to sort of manage there. One of the things I think is worth mentioning too is 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 the nature of the kinds of impacts um, and impact forces that we're trying to manage, right? So we have what is very traditionally the linear sort of what people think of when you think of a football hit, right? The linear impact directly to the shock, but but also the rotational energies that that um, are, are so problematic for for the athlete in terms of, of injury. So talking maybe a little bit about how the the Rion shock manages both of those, I think it'd be really great. Yeah, yeah, you call that another great attribute of sort of the material and geometry coming together in sort of an optimally designed solution for football. Um, and the two sort of impact sort of types that you called out there would be compression. So sort of that linear hit, which essentially compresses and compacts the shock, in which case you're taking energy out of that system through that compression. The other one, which, which you highlighted as being very important, um, especially with kind of what we know now about head health and sort of where the science is leading us, is the nature of sort of the rotational acceleration of the head. And so managing that through what we call sort of the shearing. So as you sort of, you know, kind of topple the shocks over to the side, 
to really manage that rotational acceleration of the head. And so the shearing capability of the shock um, has also been sort of optimally designed to really take that energy out uh, during an impact. We want you to stay healthy and safe out there. And if you have any other questions, I would certainly encourage you to reach out to uh, Tom Mercer at uh, teammercer at zenith.com. Appreciate your guys' time and uh, stay safe out there. Thank Thanks, you. Man.